Alleluia. Amen. Amen. Shall we pray, Jehovah? We thank you. We appreciate you for this blessed moment. We give you all the praise because you are a faithful Father. Receive our thanks and praises in Jesus' name. As we go into your message, Lord, speak to us. Glorify yourself in Jesus' name. Amen. I want to welcome us to this wonderful night. As we go into a prayer message, tag the mystery of key. The mystery of key. I will be very snappy and I want our spirit man to be alert. As God will glorify himself in the name of Jesus. I say we're looking at the topic titled The Mystery of Key. It's going to be a prayer message. I read from the book of Revelation chapter 3 verse 7. Revelation 3 verse 7. And to the angel of the church in Philadelphia write, These things said he that is holy, he that is true, he that had the key of David, he that opened and no man shut it, and shut it no man opened it. That is the book of Revelation, chapter 3, verse number 7. Beloved, God's voice to you because you are his child and like begat like is that he is giving you a divine key <clears throat> to open all miracle closed doors financial wise academic wise marital wise spiritual wise material wise or you name it and god of heaven is ready to shut all unwanted doors that your adversaries has opened for the past 213 days. Going through the year 2020, we have spent 213 days out of 366 days. You are left with 153 days to go. I speak to your life that the remaining days in this year, the right key to open and to shut, Jehovah God will deliver it to you. In the name of Jesus, I decree by the decree of heaven and I speak like God's oracle to your life. This night, every dose of failure, disappointment, marital delay, rising and falling, ill health, poverty shall be shut never to open again. In the mighty name of Jesus, and I open by the power of the Holy Ghost, the doors of profitable opportunities, doors of greatness, doors of peace, door of marital breakthroughs, financial breakthrough, academic excellence unto you in the mighty name of Jesus. And no power will be able to shut those doors in the mighty name of Jesus. Quickly, let's check the word mystery. The word mystery simply means something secret, unexplainable, an unknown truth behind an event, sometimes with puzzling or obscure nature. It is a religious truth, not understandable by application of human reasoning. First Corinthians 2.14 Bible makes us to understand by the natural man receiving all the things of the Spirit of God, for they are foolishness unto him, neither can he like or know them because they are spiritually discerned. First Corinthians 2 14. Beloved, for you to enjoy the supernatural naturally, you need to come to this consciousness. Say this loud and clear I receive the empowerment to live in the supernatural naturally. In the name of Jesus, I say you say it loud and clear. I receive. Repeat that. I receive the empowerment to live in the supernatural naturally in the name of Jesus and so shall it be in Jesus' name. The word key literally means an object designed to open and close a lock. 
it is a guide explaining the symbols or terminologies of a map or a chart. It is a guide to correct answers of tests. First Corinthians chapter 16 verse 9. First Corinthians 16 9. For a great door and an effectual is opened unto me, and there are many adversaries. For every door there is a key. That is, to every problem there is a solution. Problems are not forever. Only God is forever. Every problem or challenge has an expiration date. The day you locate the right key to unlock your problem is the day you unveil the mystery behind that problem. Today, I speak to your life that you receive the power by the Spirit of the Holy Spirit to unlock and to lock appropriately in the mighty name of Jesus. I say receive by the power of the Holy Ghost the right key to lock and unlock appropriately in the mighty name of Jesus. Key of all round possibilities, receive it in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Quickly, within the short while, we look at some keys or some mystery keys that is needed as a child of God. I told you every problem has an expiration date. Only God is forever. But you need to write, locate the right key, the right mystery key in order to open the right door at the right time in the right way to the glory of God. Number one key is a popular key we know, but we are looking at it from another direct dimension. Is the mystery key of prayer. Virtually everybody pray, but I'm looking at it from this perspective that the key of prayer in the order of Daniel. The mystery behind prayer key is that it does not only open doors, it also destroys your adversaries because every new door attracts a new adversary. New greater levels attracts new greater adversaries. But this mystery key of prayer has the capacity to deal with them, irrespective of the magnitude of their strength and operations. And so shall it be for you, in the name of Jesus. I say receive that key in the new dimension, in the name of Jesus. Every enemy in order of Daniel assigned against your life shall be destroyed, shall be disgraced and demoted in the name of Jesus. The second key is the key of thanksgiving, praises and the gratitude. They look alike but we are so many talk together because of time. Thanksgiving, gratitude and praises. 1 Thessalonians 5.18 Make us to understand that in all things we should give thanks, for this is the will of God. To avoid being granted, give gratitude to God. Learn to praise God and be thankful to God in order of David. David praised his way to God's heart and become the apple of God's eye. Never run away from God, even if you sin against God. Always run back to God. I repeat, never run away from God. Always run back to God. I release upon you the garment of praise and thanksgiving in the name of Jesus. That garment of praise and thanksgiving, receive it in the name of Jesus. If you go through the book of 2 Chronicles chapter 20, verse 22, the Bible makes us to understand that they sing and they praise God. And God sent ambushment against their enemy. As you receive this garment of praise, garment of thanksgiving, and gratitude, you will never be granted in the name of Jesus. And Jehovah God will send ambushment against every enemy of your life in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. It is a good thing to give thanks. It is a supernatural way to bring God's presence 
and to serve God in the supernatural means. I say it is a supernatural way to bring down the presence of God and it's a spiritual catalyst that enhances a speedy answers to requests and prayer. It is a mystery that makes you fight and win without stress. No matter what you are going through, learn to understand and use this powerful mystery key. And Jehovah God will glorify himself in your life. In the name of Jesus. Amen. The next key I want to release to us is the key of expectation. Expectation is said to be the mother of delivery. Mark 5, 25. The woman with the issue of blood said, For she said, If I may touch, but his cloth, that is the garment of Jesus. The woman with the issue of blood said this, our faith in Christ was loaded with expectation, and this commits God's integrity to deliver. If you want the integrity of Jehovah God to deliver to you, learn to apply the mystery key of expectation. Every moment you come before His presence, come with expectation, so that God's integrity will deliver to you. Without expectation, there is no delivery. I release upon your life the grace to understand the mystery of the key of expectation in the name of Jesus. And your expectation will not be cut short in the mighty name of Jesus. And the last key I want to release to us is the key of wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. If you go through the book of Exodus chapter 31, verse 3. Exodus 31, verse 3. And I have filled in with the Spirit of God in wisdom and understanding, in knowledge and in all manner of workmanship. James 1, 5 also makes us to understand that if any man lack wisdom, let him ask of God that giveth to all men liberally and upbraided not. It shall be given him, beloved, by Blakali. You have summed up the old knowledge, wisdom, understanding under the Spirit of God, which is the Holy Spirit in our dispensation. This key is vital in our daily activities. You don't go to an interview or and be speaking in tongues. No. You don't stand before your examiner and be praying openly never all you need is the good knowledge understanding wisdom via the holy spirit who will now crown you with favor so that god of heaven will give you success in that exam and you will receive approval to your business proposals the word knowledge is to know acquire through reading understanding is to comprehend what you are afraid and wisdom is the right application of knowledge beloved this hour i speak to your life the power of the holy ghost to receive the key of the spirit of god receive it now in the mighty name of jesus i say receive it in the name of jesus receive it in the mighty name of Jesus. And finally, before we go, or take few prayer points, you have a golden rule to play in order to get this key. And the only golden rule is to be born again. New birth is ordained to empower you for a new way of life. It makes all things new in your life. And by this, you live supernaturally in a natural way. You are redeemed to become a sign and wonder to your world, which makes God's people to walk supernaturally, natural way. Beloved, you must be born again before you can be entitled to this kiss. If you have never done that before, I will appreciate you to do that. And I pray as you do that, Jehovah God will bless his name in your life. In the name of Jesus, I want you to say this prayer with me. 
Say, as I journeyed through the remaining days of this year, I received the mystery key to open that no man can shut and to shut and no man can open. Repeat that prayer point. I received the mystery key to open and no man can shut and to shut and no man can open in the name of Jesus and so shall it be. I speak to your life. I decree by decree of heaven with the Holy Ghost. I decree by decree of heaven in the Holy Ghost. No more failure. No more disappointment. No more impossibilities. No more disgrace. That result that will cancel your insult, receive it in the name of Jesus. I say the result that will cancel the insult of your life, receive it in the name of Jesus. Jehovah God makes you whole and it is well with your soul. So shall it be. I say the right key for the right door in the right way at the right time is in your possession. And so shall it be.